Ahem, <clears throat> today, I'm going to tell you the story of the Thousand Year Door. An awfully long time ago, in a strange and far off land, a big bustling town something. Dang it. It was a town where all people lived very happy lives, and it was said that the town was very prosperous. Slow down! But one day tragedy befell this blessed place. A great chasm struck the town and its people. Darkness filled the skies, and the earth roared and shook. It was as if the very world had come to a violent end. But you know, but it, it is but a single night. The town sank to the depths of the earth. Many moons rose and set. Stories of the town passed into pages of fairy tales. And when the town's site no longer had relics, the import people gathered at the spot built new town. But word soon spread among the people who moved in that an ancient city lay deep on the ground, and that a magnificent treasure rested there. Indeed. This is the tale of the fabled treasure of Rogueport. Yes, this is where it begins, in the sea town of Rogueport. The tale of the quest for legendary treasure, and the thousand year door starts here. I love how these are always all books. Huh, <sighs> finally, I have a minute without Toadsworth watching me on something. I come all the way here on holiday only to be stuck with Toadsworth. So stifling. Once in a while, I'd like the chance to look around on my own and see what I want. But, now that I'm doing it all, it seems that this town has a very, um, distinct flavor. Oh, Missy! Missy! Do you mean... me? Yes, you, Missy! Won't you buy something? I have a wide assortment of knickknacks and doodads! Oh, well, um... Well, that's a pretty box. What's inside it? It is said that this box holds a map that shows where a legendary treasure sleeps, but the box has a magic lock on it that will only open for a pure and noble heart. As you can see, it won't so much as budge if one such as myself touches it. Ooh. I know. If the box will open to you, Missy, then you may have whatever is inside. I'm sure that whatever it is in there would be of no use to someone like me. So, Missy, take this box in our hands and see what happens. Um, alright, what's the harm? I'll try and o to open it. Aloha! This is the Green Lightning Mr. T, and welcome to my, um, long-awaited... Is that the right word? Well, anyways. Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door! Double Pain Challenge. I have been... <laughs> oh, come I just hit... Pasta. I just hit start as it did that. Well, at any rate. Um... 2004, blah blah blah. Okay, so I've been, I don't know, I haven't been saying what exactly the, ch the special thing about this has was going to be, but now you know, and please ignore that file, it doesn't, it's, <laughs> um, please ignore that file, okay, well, you're the lowest, I guess, you're the least played. Ah, these are... I see. That's right, days when I left my Wii on all day or whatever. Or GameCube. Ah, oh, this game's for the GameCube. Ah. Oh, uh. uh. It'd be nice to see a GameCube again one of these days. Just to see it. I miss it's old menu. Little noises it makes. Anyways, um, okay. So, yes, I'm erasing a file. Let's get rid of this one. I'm also going to need to get rid of another one for... 
so I have backup file in case something bad goes happen, so... Well, I'm never gonna play these anyway, so what's the use? I'll just do it. Hey! So, I'll get into, if you guys are still confused on what the Double Pain Challenge is, it's a badge that that makes you take double pain. It's solely a badge, really with no purpose, except may possibly one usefulness. It's a, it's a game challenge badge, basically. Um, I'll be getting more into it once we get towards like nearing our first battles or something like that, so... And I love the game music. Game music. Game music. Oh, naming. Nice and short. Oh, and we're getting straight into it. I am playing this on my Wii, if for anyone who cares about that. Call. Okay, um, I know this, I should have said this towards the end, but, um, for anyone who cares, um, about me and streaming and stuff, I'll be looking for a, um, update video later today about it. Alright, so, mail call! Hey bro, check it out! A letter from Princess Peach arrived for you! I'll just read it to you, how did that sound? Ahem! Now let's see here! Hello there, Mario! I am now on holiday, traveling in the Mushroom Kingdom. In my travels, I came into a possession of a mystical map, a treasure map actually. It, it was inside a box I got from an old merchant in a town called Rogueport. But since it would be too difficult for me to try to go and find treasure all by myself, I thought you could help me hunt for it. You will, of course. Won't you? This... Allah. I've included the letter... The, the, the map with the, this letter. So... Hey, hey, please bring it with you when you come. I'll meet you at Rogueport. That means you must come, Peach. Whew. Perhaps I haven't gotten all my sleep back. <laughs> uh, yesterday was probably or was a really bad day for me. Anyways, uh, what do you what do you know? It's true. There's a withered old map in here with a letter. Check it out. Well, indeed, it does look a bit weathered. I love this headset. Oh, I have to press something. Uh, well, I wanted to listen to the music. Uh, oh well. Honestly, I think it's probably these headsets that make me love the music more because I don't know. I I guess it comes through better to the headsets. So prologue. Woohoo! Hey, rogues, welcome. <laughs> This is my favorite um, of the Paper Mario games, by the way, if anyone cares. I don't know, I'm just like throwing stuff out. Excuse me, sir! Please wake up, sir! The town you've been speaking of has come into view! Look, that's Roadport! Gosh dang it! <laughs> my voice! 
It's imitating other things. Ah! You can tell what I've been watching. <laughs> you, please! We'll arrive shortly! Please prepare to disembark! Uh, departing the USS America. Um, f I must apologize, sir. Our arrival was delayed. Just on a bit of rough weather. Are you quite sure you want to disembark here? I I did tell you that the sword, all of the sordid tales about Rogueport on our way here, did I not? What's that? I, I I'm sorry. You say there's a princess waiting for you here, or er, just you? Is that so, er... Of course, sir! Well, if that's what you think, then I won't stop you. But, uh, y you be careful, sir. Don't say I didn't warn you. Oh, this guy's a total maniac. Who? what the heck? <laughs> okay, woohoo! Alright, so... Oh been forever since being the one controlling the one which I play in this game. I don't I don't recall the last time I've played this game. Oi! Welcome to Rogueport! Bit of a nasty place, eh? You got cuts coming here. You look a bit green, so I have a wee bit of advice on me. Hit that save block to save! Cause the thing about life is, you never know when you're gonna kick the old bucket. <laughs> oh, it's so much fun. Let's playing is so much fun. I do say if you have any interest. I haven't said this in a while, but if you have any interest in let's playing, you should at least try it and see how it is for yourself. So it's um the so in the past, my Paper Mario let's play was my first major let's play for me. The first two were, I believe it was the third. The first two were kind of just me getting. Um, used to let's playing or getting to the swing of it all so and then I made this paper more my big one or whatever and in that came that was back in the old days when I was absolutely insane and try, w tried to show everything in a game if you want to see stuff that I don't show off in the game play the game for yourself that's how it should be really but I will talk to people as, as I feel what you want pal huh princess in a pink dress? I ain't seen nothing like that. No, I'd remember a princess, probably. Why do you want this chick anyway, pal? Or owe you money, or is she a girlfriend? <laughs> hey, what do you want? Get away from me, freak! Oh, come off it, you airhead. I know it's tough for you, but don't play dumb with me. I've seen you walking around town asking for information about the star stars. Crystal stars. Well now, I'm doing the asking, so be a good girl and tell us what you know right now. Never, er, um, never. I don't have anything to say to you creeps. Ew. I suppose it wouldn't be right if a sassy little lass like you met with an untimely demise. <laughs> Boys, we're taking this firebrand to our fortress. As he commands, Lord Crump, we're on it. N no, stop it right there, you weirdos. I'll scream, really. Eh, uh, okay. Like, I'd go anywhere with smelly little chunks like you. <laughs> Not likely. Huh? What do you think you are doing, chump? You think you can screw up my plans? What? Me? God, it's always something. Looks like I'm gonna have to give you a little taste of the old crumb bomb. Whew, I'm going to have fun with this. Battle time, Mr. Man. Just find a way to beat this freak of the week, okay? Don't get... Don't sweat the diesel, so just jump on him and hit him with your hammer. So you there's like no way to really lose this fight. 
excuse me a moment. Um, I really need to blow my nose. Ugh, it's always something. Okay. So, ac right now, I just remembered we're actually in our first fight. So now I have to go over double pain. Double pain! The bad shit... Once it calculates... Whatever calculated damage you receive, then you receive twice it. So, you don't actually can't obtain this badge until after you complete the, sec the, the, the first chapter. Um, which was very disappointing for me. I was honestly looking forward to playing it through the first chapter. So I will be doing so! I will be ca I have pen and paper here and I will be ca calculating all the damage I take myself and be keeping track of what health I would have ha were I were to be wearing the badge. So I don't think that's too much of an issue here yet. So um, let's get to it. Okay, I need that other badge as well. <laughs> oh, we'll get into stuff later. Sweet! You know that hurt. Well, I gotta say, you're tougher than you look. Keep it up and you'll beat him in no time. Oh god, have I... I have not played this game in so long. Holy mackerel. Okay, I am... <laughs> I need to get back in the swing of things. You got him on the ropes! Come on, keep willing on him! There we go. Ah! Yeah, I only took one damage, and tch, I could have t technically gone through it with no damage. You did it! You did it! Yes! You got star points! Yeah, I bet you know, but you get these things called star points when you win battles. When you get 100 points, you go up a level. Don't forget that, okay? I, I kind of just... I don't really... I've... I don't know. Voices, I've... I pick voices for characters. I may not act completely adhere to them, but whatever. <laughs> okay, you got a couple decent shots in. I'll give you that. But unfortunately for you, that means it's go time. Punish him. Quick, this way! Whew, what a bunch of loons! Let's just sneak out of here. What do you say? Uh -huh. Stop! Where'd they go? You, Johnson! Did you see them? Did anyone? That's a lot of Johnsons. <laughs> uh, I was... He didn't even say it like that anyways. Oh, crud! They bolted. I love his voice, by the way. Or at least what I make it out to be. <laughs> wow, mister! You totally shaved me! Oh, God dang it! Ugh! Oh. Ah, uh, I am what I see. <laughs> no, dang it! You can see my life in my let's plays. Ah, oh. well, anyways, <laughs> I can't believe I just said that. <laughs> oh, dang it! You saved me. Thanks. <laughs> Oh god. I just got to give you a little reward. My name's Goombella. I'm a student of the University of Goom. Huh, <laughs> at least not the University of Doom. Nice to meet you. Yeah. Is that you or ya? Yeah? I think that was a ya. Yeah. So, uh, who are you? Is there Z? Ah, yes, it is a ya. Yeah. Mario? Wait, you mean like that famous guy? Wow. I can't believe I met you here. Cool. Anyways, no offense, but it looks like you just rolled into town yourself, right? Me? I already hate it here. There's like freaks and weirdos everywhere. It's nasty. I mean, I know the place is called Rogueport, so I should have expected it, but sheesh. I'd never come to this place if... Uh, 
a place like this if yeah I totally read that right there weren't some legendary treasure here what you're looking for the legendary treasure too seriously whoa 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 bucko what got what you got there Oh my gosh! Isn't isn't it is isn't that a treasure map? You have to tell me where you got that. Princess Peach? What? Great! No. Oh. I'm sure I gave this guy a voice. Um Great Hoogly Boogly, if it is your master Mario! Bit of a coincidence bumping into one another in this sort of place. Mmm! Ho oh, oh. ho! So tell me, Master Mar- Ugh. I, I completely forget his voice. So tell me, Master Mario, what in the world brings you to this wretched little burg? Hmm? Ah, indeed! Princess Peach sent you a letter and a treasure map. And she told you she'd meet you in Rogueport? Intriguing. I completely forget what I gave him. Jeez. You're asking me where's- uh, You're asking me where Princess Peach is? Uh, I was about to ask you that. We stopped in this town to acquire a spot of fuel for our ship, don't you know? I only took my eye off her for a moment, but as soon as... She, oh, I thought she was on vacation here. Jeez. As soon as she, I did, she vanished. You know how headstrong she is, Mario. I just assumed she'd be back momentarily. But at this point, I fear we must embrace the possibility that she may never return. Oh, what a guy. I've been at a loss to, as to what to do. I've been fraught with worry, I tell you. But I'm feeling better with you here, Master Mario. Surely we will find her. Surely. But I know my place, Master Mario. And this is not it. I leave this task to you. I believe I'm reclined in the inn right over there, and per and enjoy a spot of tea, perhaps. In fact, I highly recommend it, particularly if you find your heart or HP slash heart points running low. Just drop on in, ho ho! Yes. Anyway, a little rest there will fill up, fill all of your HP. Why am I struggling so hard? What's the last game that had a lot of dialogue? Um, what did I play last? Seriously, what, seriously, what did I play? Mario Sugar's Charge. What did I play before that? Honestly, why am I struggling? Jeez, it has been a long time since I think I've had a game where it's had a lot of dialogue. Actually, I must, or at least dialogue that's been hasn't been said, spoken. Hmm. I must say though, the rest of this town is a bit rough. Yes, rough indeed. Rough, I say. Huff, I say. Um, Princess Peach? Did he mean, like, Peach, the Mushroom Kingdom princess? The princess who always gets nabbed by Bowser? <laughs> That's how you remember her. The Koopa King? The one you rescue? Wait a sec! This is crazy! Princess Pe Peach sent you that treasure map? Whoa! This is, like, real intense! Well, where could she have gone, then? Do you think? Oh, that was a bit weird. You think maybe she got sick of waiting and went to find the treasure on her own? Ooh, ooh, I know Mario, come with me. One of my professors is here researching that treasure. We'll show him your map. If we start looking for the treasure, maybe we'll catch up to Princess Peach. Great, we're all good then. Let's go, Mario. Woo! Gumbella joined your party. Gumbella's ability. A primer! Press X to get information about nearby people, places, and objects. It's says Report Plaza. It's the center of town and the main business district. It's a crossroads where many people meet, including more than a few shady characters. Anytime you press X when there's no one around, I'll tell you about where we are. That's Goomther, the Goomba. He's always complaining about being swindled or mugged. If you press X when there's nobody nearby, I'll tell you about him or her. 
Oh, jeez, I'm just now remembering what I used to say. Icon of a button or something like that. Anyways, uh, so did you get all that? Goombella can give you hints when she answers, so talk to her for information often. And of course, Goombella can be quite helpful in battle too. She jumps in the air to attack enemies with a nasty head bonk. She can also look up enemies, enemy HP and weaknesses with her title ability. Ah, jeez, I don't know what's up with my nose today. It's interfering with my voice. It's not really good. Well, worth my breathing, which affects my voice. Anyways, first off, we gotta go and find my professor. Thing is, since I just got to town myself, I um, don't actually know where he lives. So keep an eye out. Here's what Professor Frankly looks like. Okay, so... <laughs> this was... I will generally try to go for... I've been... I don't know, I'm gonna be trying to go for 20 minute episodes, a little less, not too much more. I'd rather go under than over, perhaps. That's what I'm trying to say. So I'm going to save it here. I'm going to go take care of my nose again. Ah, why is it interfering so? And we shall continue um, playing Paper Mario. So this has been the green light. Did I even say Aloha at the beginning? Well, anyway, this has been the green lightning, Mr. T. I hope you've enjoyed the video. And to you, I say Aloha.